Hello guys, welcome back to yet another video. So OnePlus 10 Pro is receiving a new update which brings some features which we recently received on OnePlus 12 and OnePlus 11. It's a huge update and in this video we'll talk about every change what this new update brings on the table for OnePlus 10 Pro. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. Here I have my OnePlus 10 Pro. I did not receive the OTA update so I had to manually install it. If you go to about section, the latest version is .600 and it also comes with 5th March 2024 security patch. As I told you guys we did not receive the OTA update so we had to manually sideload the file and the update size was approximate 758 MB. You guys can either use Oxygen OS updater application or you can find the download links on the telegram group. Just download that file and install it manually. And guys now before moving ahead we have 87% of users who haven't subscribed to our channel so if you guys find our videos helpful to you do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video now first let's talk about the performance part so i personally did not notice any kind of improvements in the performance though we did test out bgmi and there we noticed slight improvements device did not drop frames though it was just a tdm but one thing which i would like to mention that oneplus 10 pro do heats up a lot even while playing bgmi and that too TDM matches. We mostly do gaming with 4 finger plus gyro and the FPS is set to 90 frames per second. We did not notice any kind of jitters or lag while testing BGMI but as I said device do heats up from the back side where we have the camera module on OnePlus 10 Pro. Overall in our initial testing gaming performance was good and the average FPS which device delivered was around 85 FPS. We'll also perform a dedicated gaming test on all the OnePlus smartphones to find out at what particular temperature the devices drops the frame. So you guys let us know which device we need to test first. On the previous update I've seen OnePlus 10 Pro dropping frames after device temperature reaching around 40 degrees Celsius. And here are the benchmark results with Geekbench application single core scored 1374 and multi core scores were 3776. This was without a high performance mode. With high performance mode these are the scores wherein single core scores were 1000 626 and multi core scores were 3793. We also performed the wildlife extreme stress test where you can see without high performance mode the stability scores were 62.8. We noticed 15% of battery drain while performing this test. This test is basically for 20 minutes and the frame rates were between 7 to 19 fps. Later on we also performed the same test in the high performance mode. That time also stability scores were exactly same which was 62.8 and the temperature rise and battery drain was also similar. And now let me show you the change logs. So here we have a list of change logs which are completely related to system nothing else. With this new update OnePlus have added the ability to turn on torch using the volume button. And that can be found in the gestures and motion settings. Here you can see that option which says turn on or off torch with the volume button. So you need to enable it by default this is disabled and once you have enabled this will only work if your device screen is locked or you can say the device screen is off. So as you can see the device screen have been turned off if I press and hold the volume down key the flashlight will trigger as you can see and the same way I can turn it off but it won't work when the screen is on. After that they say they have added the partial screenshot feature in the smart sidebar and this thing was already on previous build so I guess this change log have been added by mistake. When we received the update on OnePlus 12 we did check out this thing it was already present on the older builds and after that in the gallery application now you can create collage without the frames. Previously we had some options to create collage but all the options which are available under the collage section had frames. There's this first option which allows you to create a collage without having frame. The rest all other options were already present. And we have seen in past a lot of users were asking about the app specific volume feature on OnePlus smartphones. So that have also been added so if you go to sounds and vibration scroll down there's an option called app specific volume. And once you enable that you can adjust the volume for individual applications. So right now you can see I'm using YouTube music application and if I had to adjust the volume of this particular app if you tap on the volume button there's this new toggle tapping on it it will show you the particular app and from here you can adjust the volume of that specific application and guys if you're not aware oneplus is also changing the entire ui of volume sliders on oneplus smartphones so this is how the new ui will look though it covers the entire area but it's okay it looks pretty neat on any of the oneplus smartphones and the last change in which they say now you can use fingerprint unlock without waking up the screen so i'm not sure what exactly they are talking about if they are talking about this thing like without having that fingerprint icon we can unlock the device this used to happen previously also so if it's something else then do let me know in the comment section below so guys this was all about the latest update for oneplus 10 pro if you guys have any kind of questions you can let me know in the comment section below this is your friend ashok signing out see you guys in the next video